A mysterious letter is said to be the reason for mass resignations in a small Washington County borough. North Charleroi residents woke up to the news that they no longer have a mayor, along with a few other key positions in the bureau, borough. Our Shelley Bortz has been digging into this all day and joins us live at the borough building with details. Shelley? Well, residents here are left scratching their heads, wondering how this could have happened and more importantly, why? Um, I don't know who's running what now. A borough without a government is how many in this community describe the state North Shalleroy is in, even the mayor himself, following mass resignations. Chrissy Cardinal, who has served as a solicitor for 27 years, was the first to resign. Then, like dominoes, three more resignations came, from the mayor to council member Cynthia Randall, to president of the council, Carrie Zaletsky, and finally, councilman Dave Deese. Deese stepped down as he is no longer a resident of the borough. As for the other three, no reason was given for their abrupt departure, but word of an anonymous letter may be partially to blame. Anything, though, you could just tell us about this anonymous letter? No. Okay. I'm sorry. Mayor Steve Haga was tight-lipped today, but was quoted at last night's meeting saying the letter was so vulgar he was uncomfortable repeating it. A councilman even went a step further, saying the three women who resigned took a beating in the letter. Somebody had sent a letter that was, uh, I guess, really went after the solicitor, and she's a really nice person, so... I don't know what that was all about. The contents of the letter wasn't discussed other than that she was, you know, very upset about the, the content of it. News of the resignations is all the buzz in this small community today. Many people who live here say they understand why the officials stepped down if there's truth in the letter, but add they're worried about the future. It's really sad because they're really nice people. All the people that I heard resigned, um, I've lived here 10 years and they're really good neighbors. So if somebody's threatening them, it's terrible. All resignations here take effect January 31st. Reporting live tonight, Shelley Bortz, KDKA News.